Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to highlight something on a document within Avid Media Composer. So to start out, I've got a police report, generic one right here on the desktop. And it's important you know where the original document is, and I'll show you why in a second. So it's right here on the desktop. I'm going to open Avid. And I have already pulled that report into my bin, PD report JPEG. So now we are going to put this, I'm just putting in and out about 10 seconds and I lay that in a timeline. The next thing we're gonna do is go up here to Image, Avid Pan and Zoom, and I am going to pull that effect over. Now up here in the Effect Editor, we're gonna change Display to Target, and we're gonna import the image, and that's where we go back here to the desktop and find that original file, PD Report. So from there, I can go up here and I can resize it and zoom in and not lose uh, quality. It won't blur or anything like it would if you used a picture-in-picture -picture or, um, or a 3D warp. And so then all I'm going to do is I'm going to get to the point that I want. And this is just for um, effect or to show you so it's clear, but let's say right there. Now, let's just say up here the date and time this occurred right here. This is what I want to highlight. So within Media Composer, what you do is go up to the Effect Palette, go to Image, go to Spot Color Effect, and drag that on a line above your B-roll line, or the clip of the uh, police report. So from there, we go into the Effect Editor, and we want to edit this Spot Effect. And all you do is you grab the little uh, rectangular tool, if it's... Um, an even document like this. If not, you may have to use this tool here and you know draw your lines. But all I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little box over top what I want to highlight. And you'll see it didn't do anything. So we go over here into the effect editor and what we're looking for is color gain. Turn that on and pull the blue all the way back to zero and now you've got a yellow highlight on your document. Click out of it and there it is. You've now highlighted a document inside of Media Composer.